Hello and good morning y'all and welcome to Silent Lake Outpost. So this is a horror game that's going to take place in a firewatch tower in this forest called Silent Lake and I'm down with the concept. Sounds pretty cool to me. I'll have the game linked in the description down below if you want to check it out yourself. But let's see what this is all about together. Silent Lake Outpost. You have a job at Silent Lake Forest as a park ranger, and you have been working there for a week. You have sometimes been hearing strange noises in the woods, but have thought nothing of them, thinking it's just your paranoia kicking in. But you would soon find out that it isn't just your paranoia giving you company in these woods. Okay. So I'm assuming like the weird kind of like box kind of like not full screen textures because I played this game in 1440p. Maybe it's not coded for that. I don't know. Uh, damn it, the generator's down again. I need to go turn it onto the bottom of the tower. I should take my flashlight with me. Okay, flashlight. Flashlight. Well, it looks like a flashlight. Uh, ooh, hello. Equip, unequip. Oh, there we go. We got a typewriter up here. What year is it? What else we got here? Looks like we got some sardines, some tuna, some good cookware. Looks like a toaster oven, binoculars. That's definitely a chessboard, a clock, a nice alarm clock. Nice. It's a cool little tower. That's a map. That's a map. All right. Let's go find this generator. It's probably under here, right? Yeah. I was like, the generator's not going to be going away from the place. That looks like a generator to me. Turn on. Cool. Now the generator's on, I should look around the forest with my binoculars before I sleep. I left binoculars inside. Oh, I, saw, I already saw those. Those are uh, on the little table next to the bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello. No murderers, please. It's a horror game. Probably a murderer. Or a rabid bat. Or someone trying to sell me something. Pick up binoculars. Uh, so, B to equip and unequip. Scroll wheel to zoom. M1 to use. Okay. What are we doing? Hello! Ooh, beautiful day down there. Hello, hello. Oh god, the mouse sensitivity when you scroll in that much. Oh, hello. What is this? A camp? No one should be camping here right now. I better go check it out. How dare they be camping? We're just gonna go walk down there. Gonna go follow the path. I have some, like, loud, heavy-ass footsteps, dude. Alright. Is this the wrong path? I should take the other one. There's another path? This? Ooh. Let's go. I will say, there is some, like, wicked optimization issues in this game already. My PC is struggling for some reason right now. I don't know what it is. I need to put out that fire. Okay. Seems kind of rude. Looks like there's some people just trying to live their life, you know? Put out fire. Cool. Who left this fire? There is nobody here. What's going on there? What does this meat? Smells disgusting. Just leaving, or go follow the path? I guess we're gonna follow the path. Okie dokie then. Oh, back in a little tower. Yuck and yuck. I'm tired, time to go sleep. Yeah. Uh, I put out the fire with the other people, though. They're gonna struggle to sleep. But I'm allowed. Why? Because I got a big old tower? Wear a forest ranger badge? It's kind of fucked up, if you ask me.
Sleep. I want to sleep with the flashlight on, though. Who's they, uh... Huh, someone's knocking on the door? Alright. Hello? Anybody here? No? Oh. Is that an arm? It says read no. Oh, R. You are next. Need to use my radio inside to contact the authorities. Sure. Damn it, the radio's not working. It seems like the battery has run out. Of course it has. Alright, so what do we do? Just die? I remember there's an old forest ranger living around here in a cabin. I should hike there and try and get some help. And maybe find some spare batteries. We're just gonna leave. I guess we're just gonna leave the hand there. There we go. You take care. Keep the door closed. I'm going to presume we're gonna go down the path that told me was the wrong way the first time, which I think was just straight. I'm gonna assume, yeah. Sweet. What's going on here? That's an arm. Well, I'm just gonna give this, uh, whoever this killer is a hand. They're doing big things. Are they dying here, or what's happening? Uh. Can't go upstairs? Why can I go upstairs? Oh. We got, like, some Blair Witch stuff up there. I wanna go up there. Looks like a freaking maniac's up there. I'm looking for? Uh, filing cabinet, maybe? Oh, hello. Batteries. Yay, great. Got the batteries to head back to the tower now. <laughs> Tom the Tamale Klutz. I really need to hurry. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Tom always falling from high places. Of course he is. Why wouldn't he be? That full night will work, though. My hand's still there. Sir. So, you see there's a hand on the door? I love how, like, this isn't, like, properly centered. Sorry, it's, that's very loud. Hold. There we go. I love how, like, the... Because, like, I don't think this game was uh, designed with 1440p in mind, so, like, these, like, things here just, like, don't frame correctly. I just love that he's, like, constantly running into us right now, and the door is just still chilling on the arm. Mwah. Um, but, yeah, that was, uh... What was it called? Silent Lake Outpost. Uh, it's not bad. Um... Not really much to it, per se, but it all worked. Uh, some optimization issues, uh, from what I can tell, but beyond that, you know... You got a little Firewatch-style horror game. Nothing really bad there. Was this anything spectacular? No. But I kind of looked. I uh, liked looking around the environment, looking at the lake. Um, I have mixed feelings about the game just kind of like fading to black and bringing you to areas you walked on the trail. But at the same time, it would have been a super long walk and would have just been a lot of filler if we had to actually walk the full length of the trails. And I'd imagine that would probably make the optimization even worse, having to, like, render in, like, all the paths and stuff. So I'm cool with that. Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, that was pretty cool for what it was. I uh, wish there was more story, Wish we kind of knew more about, like, what was killing us, why we're getting killed. But, you know, it's just a great mystery. It's a little jump scare horror game. It did what it wanted to do. No complaints. Uh, that was Silent Lake Outpost. Again, that'll be linked in the description down below if you want to play it yourself. But that's going to do it for this video. So thank you all very much for watching. Y'all have a lovely day. And as always, toodles, y'all.